In this video, I'll discuss five misconceptions about blue light blocking glasses. Recent years, it has been a huge trend, blue blocking glasses that are supposed to make you sleep better. They come in many shapes and colors. Some of them have clear lenses, some of them are yellow, and some of them are red. And some completely cover the eyes, and some only filter the light from the front. And finally, some you have to wear all day long, and others only in the evening. The first misconception is that the glasses only have to filter the blue light that enters your eyes from the front. This is not the case. Both daylight and artificial light in your home contains blue light. This light enters your eyes from the top and reaches the bottom part of the retina of your eyes. This part of your eyes contains blue light sensitive eye cells that are very sensitive to blue and white light. They are called intrinsically photosensitive retinoganglion cells. But for now, let's call them blue light detectors. So we've got a built-in system that is very sensitive to light that enters your eyes from the top. So what's the verdict? It doesn't matter how strong the filters of the glasses are. If the glasses do not protect you from the blue light from the top or from the sides, they will not help you to sleep better. They're fancy, but they will not improve your sleep. The second misconception is that clear lenses can filter blue light and make you sleep better. These glasses are called blue blocking glasses. However, they only filter out 10% of the blue and green light spectrum. And this is the light spectrum that affects your sleep the most. Sellers call them blue blocking glasses, but they are not blue blocking glasses. Proper sleep glasses have a stronger filter and block a larger part of the light spectrum, which also contains a bit of the green light. As a result, they either have orange or red lenses. Also very important, all the studies that showed the benefits of blocking blue light for better sleep have been done using these kinds of glasses. Zero of them have been done using these kinds of glasses. Although they say the clear glasses have been scientifically proven to improve sleep, it's not the case. The verdict? It's a big marketing stunt. They will not help you to sleep better. It's like having a raincoat that blocks only 10% of the rain. You'll be totally soaked, right? The third misconception is that screen light is the primary source of blue light. The lighting in your room contains blue light and the intensity of this room light is much higher in intensity than the screen light. A recent study conducted in 2019 from the University of Melbourne has shown that dim room light of 30 lux can suppress melatonin by 50%. Also, it delays the secretion of this important sleep hormone and powerful antioxidant by 70 minutes. It's also important to note that 30 lux is much lower in intensity than the light in your living room, bedroom or bathroom. This shows that room light can disrupt your biological clock and sleep and it's not just the blue light from the screens. The fourth misconception is that blue light is bad for your sleep. This is not the case. Daylight contains over a thousand times more blue light than the lights from your screens. The exposure to blue light is actually good for your sleep. However, it's all about the timing. During the day, blue light is good for your sleep. It resets your circadian rhythm and promotes alertness. However, before bedtime, when the sun has set, you need to completely filter out all blue light. Before the invention of artificial light, it was dark for at least two hours before bedtime, without any blue light. So what's the verdict? Wearing blue blockers all day long will not help you to sleep better. It might even make you sleep worse. You have to filter out all blue light for one or two hours before going to bed. The fifth misconception is that dimming the lighting in your home in the evening is also enough. Studies have shown that dimming light is not always enough. Some people are 50 times more sensitive to blue light in the evening than others. As discussed before, even relatively dim room light of 30 lux can negatively impact your circadian rhythm and sleep. Think about it. Back in the days when we did not have any artificial light, we were used to have at least two hours of darkness without blue light before bedtime. And nowadays you only spend one second in darkness, just when you switch off the lights before closing your eyes. Our solution, wear the Somno Blue glasses before going to bed. Add them to your relaxing bedtime ritual and better prepare your brain and body for sleep. 
we introduced Somno Blue. These sleep promoting glasses have the strongest blue to green light filter, which filters the light from every angle. You don't have to wear them all day long. Wear them approximately one hour before bedtime and experience a more refreshing sleep. Somno Blue is currently being applied by professional athletes, soldiers, healthcare professionals, and knowledge workers in order to recharge more effectively. You sleep one third of your life. Better make the most of it.